welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, hey, my name's Lizzie. Be sure to subscribe and to join our arcade family today. We are getting so, so close to 400,000, so please be sure to join the family if you guys have not already subscribed. Also guys, be sure to drop a like if you guys enjoyed this video, and if this video gets to 10,000 likes, I will do a part two of my favorite claw machine tips, secrets, hacks, and tricks that you guys might not already know. Anyways, for today's video, I do show you guys some of my best arcade tips for round one arcades, specifically, mostly. This goes for round one or other UFO catchers, but it can be applied to other arcades as well. These are secrets that the arcade does not want you to know. They don't like to tell you guys, and because of course arcades want to make money and they want people to struggle to win, but I'm going to decode these claw machines for you guys and show you guys my best tips, tricks, and secrets that you guys might not know about how to win from these UFO catchers and or claw machines at round one arcade. So without further ado, let's just get right on into my special secrets. All right guys, so we're gonna play this hook claw machine and as you can see here There is a hook on this claw machine down here There are circular rings and if you hook the ring and pull it all the way up you get to choose a prize from the back So let's see if we can do it The best tip I can give you guys with this is to really go for the one that's closest So when I hit this button to go to the right get it directly in the middle and then go directly up on it As close as you can and it might hook. Let's give it a try. All right guys. Here we go Let's see if we can get it about there and about here that might be good come on oh that might have it that genuinely might be it first go come on oh it just missed it all right here we go again that was super super close and it's in a good position this this hook all right it might be too far to the right it might swing up on it though we'll see oh my gosh oh i hit into it There'd be probably no way now because I hit into it with the claw thing. Yeah. You gotta be careful to hit, not hit in with the top of it though, that's for sure. That looks good. Come on. That might. Oh, it's kind of swinging though. Gotta go more to the left. Definitely. <gasps> oh! Never mind! Wow! Okay, we did it! No way, look at that guy. See that? Completely hooked. It literally just swung back and it hooked on there. That is one of the easiest games to win. Arcade workers don't want you to know that it's easy. They want it to look hard, but use the tip I just taught you guys to win that claw machine because genuinely, it is easy. Maybe like four to five times if your aim is good, you will win this claw machine. That's how easy it is. Practice Perfect. That's way easier than some of the other claw machines in round one though So if you guys go to round one look for these hook ones because that's a secret arcade workers and owners don't want you to know All right guys, so we got the huge hedgehog. Look how cute it is. Yay! That was an awesome win. All right guys So the next arcade hack is see this little block thing right here that I'm zooming into That is the count of how many wins there were on a claw machine for the day at round one There were five wins. I don't know if you guys can see that number five there. There were five wins today on this claw machine right here. So, knowing that, usually they keep the strength pretty high if there was five wins on this machine. So, we're hoping it's gonna be strong still, but let's see if we can actually push this down into the prize chute. So it's saying to poke there, which is like right about here on the plush, so we're gonna try to do that and see if it works. Okay, let's hope it's still going pretty strong. About here and here. Let's see if it does anything. Come on, be strong. <gasps> Oh my gosh, this is strong. That is a hack that they don't want you to know. Okay, one more push and we've got this. There's definitely five wins today on this. They're about to be six. So always look for those little black things at the top of the claw machines. That is a secret that most people don't know. All right, here we go again. This is a very good win, guys. This is a huge plush. About here and here. Come on. Come on, boy. Oh! easy two wins and this is a really nice plush guys these are like licensed they're huge look at that guys this is an awesome plush arcade workers don't want you to know this because that's how they track how strong a machine is or isn't so that's how you win those machines all right here's another one that says five on there i don't know if you guys can see that let me zoom in really close yep top of the machine says five on the counter so this one right here is in a great position, guys, because not only can you hit it with the left claw and hopefully not get it stuck in between, because usually when you hit it here, it will get stuck between, but we're gonna try to like kind of push it out by the back legs or something. It says to poke there. I mean, we could try to poke it there and make it fall. Sometimes you get lucky, sometimes you don't, but this should be strong, so let's just give it a shot. All right, 
Let's see if we can hit it correctly. I'm deciding if I want to go for the back legs or if I want to go for the front. Um, I'm going to go for the front and be risky. Let's see if we can push it in by the neck. Maybe. If it stabs just right. Oh, yeah! One play! What? Oh my gosh. That is crazy, guys. That's how you win these claw machines. Alright, guys. So this counter right here has three counted on it. As you can see right there, it says three. So that means there's three wins today on this one. So it's in a pretty good position. We're going to try to stab it right here and go to the left and see if it will drag it at all. Okay. Let's see how strong this is. Hopefully they didn't change the strength about here and here. Will that push it at all? That opens so wide. Maybe. Uh, uh, uh. Maybe though the leg went down. Actually, if I can get it between the loop. Oh my gosh. It is. It is going to go one more play. That was strong. Okay, yeah. One more and it's going to definitely fall. That is so easy. Yeah, never try to pick these up, guys. You just always got to try to stab them. So about here and here. Oh, that might be too far back though. If it doesn't get on top of the head. Uh, oh, yep, that's enough. We did it guys in two plays. Wow, that is insane guys. That's how you win the claw machine. Those are the secrets to winning. Guys, they restocked this. This is also another thing. If they restock it and you're still at the arcade, why not come back for another one? It's still gonna be strong. If you know it's strong, you could probably win it again. Usually, unless it's a payout rate. But at round one, that's usually how it goes. So, take advantage. If I'm gonna pay for a $50 game card, I'm gonna make sure that I do my best to win as much as I can. So, we're gonna try to do the same thing again and hopefully get it on point about here and here and hopefully push it in again. That looks pretty decent. Oh my gosh. Oh, one play. I told you. Oh my gosh, guys. That is how you win at round one. These are the secrets nobody tells us. Look at that. My mom's holding a pile of plush right now. I won this so far and I still have so many credits. I'm banking today. All right, guys. This is another really big prize. It's a cat with a bell on it. Look how cute it is. So this one says it has three wins today. Literally, that's like the biggest secret I can teach you guys is always check the counter. All right. Nine credits to play, let's give it a shot. Can we get the big kitty? We're gonna try to roll her on in. About here-ish. Let's see if that will do anything. Oh, she's big. I might have jammed this one actually. Now we're gonna have to push for the upper head and see if we can get it to fall down. It is pretty strong though, I will say that. All right, hopefully I didn't jam it too much. We'll find out by this next play how much it is jammed. About here and here. That's perfect. All right, let's see if that does anything. Oh no, I think I jammed it because the ear is stuck on top of the prize display. When you ruin them guys, I do intend to walk away. It would be a lot of money to win now. All right guys, so I found this really big claw machine. It has seals, it has axolotls. I really love the axolotl up top guys. It's so cute. Let's see if we can try to win this seal here. It's getting kind of close. It is 12 credits to play though. But okay, so I do have a secret to these claw machines too. And you guys gotta listen very carefully about what the secret is for this. Super simple. When you push it once guys, when it's down where you want it, push it twice. It's called double tap. Ready? Three, two, one, once and twice. Double tap, hold, hold. Oh my gosh. Oh, now it's closer though. I feel like in a few plays this might be able to go. So that's the double tap secret. Arcades don't want you to know that because it gives you a better clamp when you do double tap. Here we go again. All right, let's see if we can get it. Honestly, if I win this, I low-key might ask to trade it for the axolotl because I just want that so bad. All right, let's go right about here and let's see if the double tap method will work. Come on, down and double tap. Hold, 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 hold. That might be it. Oh, I feel like it's gonna happen. Look how close it's getting. All right, let's keep trying. These ones do have payouts, by the way, guys. So really the only way you can win is by double tapping and getting it to accidentally drop it in the prize chute or just getting payout on these bigger machines. All right, right about here. We're gonna also always center it where the middle of the claw meets the middle of the prize. Come on, double tap. Okay, come on, it's gonna drop it pretty fast. But, oh, no way! It fell into the prize chute. Look how cute it is. It's literally a jumbo mumbo seal, guys. That is crazy. Double tap definitely does work. It helps a lot. Guys, they put an axolotl out. I have to win it. Look at how cute it is. It's a little salamander. Oh my gosh. Okay, here we go. Let's see if we can get it. Come on, axolotl. I love you a whole axolotl. All right, we're gonna go about here, right on top. And we're gonna use the double tap. Double tap. 
double tap double oh it got so much weaker so that is going to do it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed this video like i said guys if this video helps you out or you guys enjoyed it please drop a like on the video let's try to get this video to 10k likes guys that would be so amazing and if we do i'll do a part two also comment down below letting me know what you guys think about these tips or tricks and also comment down below if you guys have any other tips or tricks of your own that you guys would like to share with me and everybody else in the comments about how you guys personally win claw machine those are some of my favorite tips to share for you guys at round one arcade especially those little clickers up top on the machine those are things that i don't think a lot of you guys knew about but i have known about that for a little while now and i've been taking mad advantage of that and i think that's like the biggest hack i kind of explained today is always look for those little clickers to see the strength of a claw machine on a day-to-day -day basis anyways guys thank you all so much for watching the video we had an awesome day today at the arcade we literally won so many prizes like literally so many so it was a pretty successful day anyways guys if you guys have not followed my social media all of them are linked in the description down below instagram is lissy noel twitter is not lissy and also lissy noel.com is where i sell my merch and all the stuff i win on my channel so go check it out you guys are amazing thank you for watching till the end of this video and i'll see you guys in the next video bye arcade family